Guys, you're not going to be transported to FEMA camps during the worst of this particular outbreak, and I'll talk about how, how bad it's going to get. But what will happen is, you remember that the U.S. government practiced this zombie apocalypse drill? Well, the zombie apocalypse effectively was an exercise to seal off cities. You don't go in it and you don't come out, whether by rail or road or plane. That, in, in essence, is, is going to be a substitute for FEMA camps. So look forward to that happening very, very soon, by the way, from state to state to state, from city to city to city, instead of this idea of FEMA camp. You'll be not only quarantined, the Constitution will be violated. You won't be able to travel. That's coming. How bad is this pandemic going to get? Oh, take a look at Spain and Italy right now. And as I, as I told you guys what's coming, what we saw as remote viewers was mass graves, lime pits. Guess what? The country of Ecuador is started digging a huge burial pit because their medical systems and their mortuaries can't handle the number of deaths and the trajectory, the velocity of people dying in that country. They, they, uh, the U.S. is in far better shape. Uh, we have a lot of equipment, not enough, but a lot. And we have the specialists and we are prepared for a pandemic. Not as much as we would like to be, but far more than other countries. This is the first month of real hardship in our country. And people are not going to get a paycheck. A lot of people are not going to get a paycheck. Next month, it will probably be 30% unemployment rate. That's, the, that's, that, that's a conservative figure. So what are people going to do with the little money they have left? Buy gas, medicine, food, probably. You're not gonna pay your mortgage or your rent. 